before, the Fourth of July City. I think there's an expectation. Um, we could limit the types of fireworks. That's probably more common. Um, but uh, it's I just don't know how you how you could effectively address the issue in a way that would one be enforceable and two even make sense. Because let's be honest, even if we pass the city ordinance, you, you take one foot out in the county and you know light it off. I mean, how do we stop that? Especially when it's the noise is the issue, and the noise can be heard a long ways. Um, so yeah, you should have been here for the debate when we reduced it to what we are now. It used to be like ten days, yeah. right? Yeah, wow. we had a lot of upset citizens, and we uh, reduced it. Yeah, it's, it was a good call, but just for me, it's a historical thing. I think it's set by state statute now. I think they give you a window, and you can be as big as that window and shrink as much as you want. But because there's a second window. There is, in Arco too. Over New Year's. New Year's. Yeah, yeah, Christmas time. Yeah, there's, 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 yeah, there's a nice. couple of few days there you can legally do it. But here's the problem, no one's selling. So you, so make sure you save <laughs> your fireworks Thank in a you. safe yeah. 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 Hold a few back for a few New Year's yeah. celebrations. Is that a mayor endorsement for shooting fireworks? <laughs> but you can get a special permission. <laughs> I think if Nebraska, if Nebraska wins a bowl game, then you should be right. <laughs> that would be good. That might be a while. Any bowl game. <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> Any other requests or items from the council? If not, then uh, Jonathan, welcome. Thank you, Mayor. What's going on, Seward? All right. Uh, so we are hosting a party for forty thousand of our closest friends here. A couple days from now. Uh, lots of calls for people about the weather. Um, so you know, if people have questions, you can send them our way. We can help with that um we'll post it all yes facebook page yeah. that's where we've been sending a lot of people you know what's happening with the weather yada yada so, yeah, so rain or shine it's on posters we still get the questions it's gonna be on the fourth of july <laughs> yes it is with confidence good times uh let's see there's gonna be a ribbon cutting upcoming for the blue river rest area sculpture bridge it's been closed for a while uh wednesday july 10th 10, 10 a.m Another ribbon cutting Friday, July 26th at noon with Desert Glow in downtown Seward. We have an upcoming professional development luncheon on Friday, August 30th about uh, working with Generation Z in the workplace. Yes, we're there. And then uh, lastly, we just encourage you to, um, yeah, uh, frequent the county. We have a lot of other sister cities across uh, the county who are having awesome community festivals as well. So I know a lot of people come here for the fourth, and I think we should be reciprocal and support them as well. So a lot of that stuff will be in the Blue River Buzz, our weekly electronic newsletter. Keep up to date on that. That's all I have. Thanks, Mary. Right, thanks, Jonathan. And with that, is there a motion to adjourn? Okay. A motion and a second. Who better shoot your votes? You need to sway the votes. That's what we'll do. All right. Thank you all. Have a good night. What's